These pictures speak for themselves. Here's the new Safro, weighing in at 8 tons and apparently flying over the water. This leap forward has been possible thanks to the yellow appendages which stick out on either side of the hull, looking like Salvador Dali's moustache, and which are referred to as foiling daggerboards. The faster the boat sails, the more efficient these foiling daggerboards. Safran was the first to test them. A foil is made up of two parts, a shaft and a tip. The foil is immersed on the same side as the sails to limit the amount of heel, with the tip offering lift to the boat, which sails higher in the air, reducing the wetted surface and therefore the drag. The foils complement the work done by the canting keel, which already takes the weight off the hull. This thrust in the opposite direction increases with speed and gradually the boat is raised up out of the water. The result is an incredible gain in speed. Almost two knots with a strong wind on the beam, which is when these new appendages work most efficiently. Apart from the gains in speed, the foils reduce the pitching of the boat, offering greater stability under autopilot and contributing to improving safety when sailing. The only drawback is that these foiling dagger boards are not that efficient in light winds and when the boat has to sail upwind, but these weather conditions are not very common in the Vendée Globe. The Safran sailing team has a few months left to go before the start of the race to work on improving the performance in these two points of sail.